Hey, hey, hey! Today we're talking about Swamp King Dread. I've been wanting to talk about this card since I first saw it. Of course, we'll do a lethal puzzle at the end. Swamp King Dread. This card means a lot to me. And not because it's a huge scary dinosaur. It's because it's a 7 mana 9-9 nine, nine with an upside? Let's look at the history of Hearthstone. We all know there's been some great 6 mana cards. Sylvanas, Savannah High Main, Fire Elemental, Cairn, just to name a few. These were all released in a basic set of cards. What about 8 mana cards? Oh, Ragnaros, Tyrion, Alakir, Grom Hellscream. Some very strong cards that are often used. Now let's take a look at 7 mana cards. Archmage Antonidas stands out. But you can't play it under 7 because you want to play a spell with it. Ancient of Lore was good when you could still draw two cards. Ancient of War is a good defensive card. Baron Geddon was sometimes used in Control Warrior. They realized 7 mana minions were a bit weak. So they made Dr. Boom. Which was way too strong for 7 mana. Everyone played it. It was 7 mana for 9-9 stats on board plus a big upside. Blizzard realized Dr. Boom was just too strong. So they continued making more underwhelming 7 mana cards afterwards. There are some 7 mana taunt minions that saw some play. Also Abyssal Enforcer was good. Overall 7 mana cards have always been the worst mana slot. Not worth their mana cost. Too slow on board, too low in value, there's just no place for them. The opportunity cost is too high. That's why I'm excited to see Swamp King Dread. 7 mana for 9-9, nine, nine. not a 7-7, seven, seven, not a 7-8, a 9-9 nine, nine, dammit, with a nice ability. Is this ability an upside though? After your opponent plays a minion, attack it. It means your opponent can use his minions on board and his minions from his hand to trade in as efficiently as possible. It's as if every minion he plays gains charge and attacks into Swampkin Dread. Playing Swampkin Dread will give your opponent a lot of initiative. This also means he can activate death rattles as he wishes. However, Sylvanas is going to wild, so there doesn't seem to be any great death rattle minions left. Notice it says play, so it doesn't detect summoned minions as a result from battle cries, death rattles or maybe even spells. Because this is a 7 mana 9-9 beast, it has great synergy with Tundra Rhino. Imagine charging a 9-9. So maybe we'll see some more Tundra Rhinos, especially since Blizzard has been trying to make Hunters slower, a less smorky class. Leave a comment below, do you think Swamp King Dread is going to see much play, or is it another garbage scan card? Let's go over today's 100% lethal puzzle. Oh my god, he has a Swamp King Dread on the board! How are we going to kill him now? He's even at 16 health even. And we just have a shitty 4-4 rat pack and a blue gear warrior on board. We have Kill Command, Tundra Rhino, Leash the Hounds, Emperor Cobra, Timber Wolf, Spawn of Nazoth and Hound Master in hand. We have 9 mana and hero power available, but not sure if that's enough to deal with that dinosaur. Are you the hero that can spot lethal? Leave a comment below. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.